Hey everybody, hey, welcome back to more Resident Evil 7. Well, most likely the demo of Resident Evil 7. How are y'all doing today? I hope y'all are enjoying E3 as much as I am. All the great game releases, all the new freaking game announcements, all the new game trailers. This is Resident Evil 7. It was previously announced at our E3. I'm not sure about the release date though, but I know that if you're a PlayStation Plus um, member, for if you have a PS4 and you have a PlayStation Plus membership, you can definitely get this game for free. So I highly recommend, you know, getting a PlayStation Plus, getting this game for free, and trying it out, because it is freaking scary as shit. In the last part, we kind of got a little bit of the story. We kind of got what's, what's happening here a little bit. We're kind of like a, a crew on a, like a TV show who basically heard something about this haunted house, and we came to investigate it and film it for the show. But, you know, I kind of don't like the feel of this place. I have a very bad feeling that some some, some shit's about to go that that we're gonna enter to this cross place and there's gonna be a zombie there or a fucking ghost about to fucking possess the shit out of us and tear us the fucking part. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe everybody. And I'm gonna pose a question for you guys. What was your most favorite or most anticipated game release or game announcement that was made at E3 2016? Leave it in the comment section. I really wanna know what your thoughts are. Let's get into this guys. Okay, stand back up. So, for me personally, my, like, favorite game announcement would had to be First, God, the new God of War. Nice of Either it has to be the new God of War or this one, Resident Evil 7. Because I am a huge Resident Evil fan. And the fact that Resident Evil 7 is going back to its horror roots, and it's going back to what made Resident Evil so great, is amazing. And the new God of War is just... I was actually a little bit confused about the new God of War. Because, oh my gosh, dude. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, shit! What the fuck? Oh my. Oh my god! What the fuck is going on? The fuck just happened? Wait a minute, what the fuck? What the fuck? Oh! I'm still dashing against the stones. You! That wasn't there the first time. That wasn't... Okay. Okay, so... No, so, so basically, Luca's not happy with us. So basically, the ghost or shit, that dude is not happy with us being here. So he's gonna come and tear our assholes out. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so as, as I was saying before, before we, you know, we got freaking kidnapped by that whatever that weird guy is doing there, that... I was in the new God of War... I was a little hinky at that. Like, I know, like, yeah, I'm excited. Oh my gosh, fucking mad and fucking weird. But, like, yeah, oh my gosh, the new God of War. Even though that I'm pretty sure with God of War 3, they said that that will be the last God of War. Until they... Was that fucking there? What the fuck? Was that fuck? No. No, 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 I need to find a fuse. I need to find a fuse. Where the fuck is the fuse? Where the fuck is the fuse? Okay, that's... The, okay, please tell me I'm not, I'm not going crazy. Those Mackies were turned around. And they... That Mackie... Okay, you know what? I'm going to have to ask you to please stop that game. Yeah, okay, I'm going to please ask you to stop, stop the scares. Shit, okay, so I'm, I'm going to need to find a fuse. But where the fuck is the fuse? So... Okay, we need to find... Oh, wait a minute, the cupboard. That's right. Maybe we have to go back in the cupboard. And maybe that's where the fuse is. Okay, that's actually a lead, because we didn't see the cupboard until we saw the video, and the only way to get to the cupboard is through the fireplace. Yeah, 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 the fireplace. We go in here, and there's like a switch in the fireplace. We open that up, and there's a cupboard, right? Yeah. Here we go. Ready? Unopen sesame. All right then. Okay. Okay. Here, here, here is where Lucas died. Oh, down there is where he died, but... Okay, okay. Guys, guys, I'm scared. Uh, ew, ew! Back door key. We have a key to the... Okay, okay, we have a lead. We have a lead, okay. We can't go down there, but we have the key to the back door. Which is very... Okay, so you know, here's the plan, guys. We're gonna go to the back door. Most likely, that will be where the next few... You guys hear that, right? You guys... Fuck, please let me hear that. Please let me hear the, the footsteps. Please, please let me hear the footsteps. I'm going, okay, okay, okay. You know what? You know, whatever, whoever's up there, dude... Dude, I'm gonna ask you to please. Well, I have a key, so maybe not. Maybe okay. Maybe it's the other door. Maybe it's the other door. But I hear footsteps, and that means people are. What the fuck is going on? There? Hey, quiet down up there. Okay, quiet down. 
To, I'm exploring here! Fucking exploring! I'm your ass down! Damn ghosts. Always making a ruckus in this place. Excuse me. Excuse me, ghosts. Excuse me, ghosts. Oh, 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 oh no, Gabe! <laughs> don't do this to me, Gabe! Please, I don't need a, I don't need another heart attack. I already played zombie. I already had heart attack with zombie. I'm not having heart attack in this game. Okay, uh, back door key. But okay, so we're gonna need the dummy finger. And we still need bulk. Okay, do we still need this though? <laughs> Welcome to the family. Oh! Yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? Who the fuck was that? We gotta get the hell out of here. Yeah, no shit, dude. He's got fucked up by who the dude behind you? Dude, dude behind you. Oh, oh my fucking gosh! What the fuck? Oh my gosh! What the fuck is that? Is that the hills? Was that ghost bitch from Silent Hills? Did ghost bitch make a return? <laughs> okay. Okay. The family is expecting you early 2017. To open the door to ready my program. Okay. Okay, what the fuck? Someone explain to me what the fuck? Please explain to me. What the fuck? Was that it? Press any Oh, that was it! That was okay! Wow! So that was Resident Evil 7, guys. That was a demo for Resident Evil 7. Please leave thoughts on this so far. Do you do you think that Capcom is doing the right decision of making Resident Evil 7 going back to its horror roots? And do you think that it that they really like really made it horror-y? Because me personally, yeah, they made it fucking horror. -y. I was I was literally at the edge of my seat the entire time playing this demo. It's fucking scary as shit. It fucking Oh my god, I mean, if the entire game's gonna be like this, I really, really want love to play it, and I will definitely be doing a series for this. When Resident Evil 7 comes out, it will definitely, definitely do a series on it, and I just really hope that it doesn't have the same fate as Silent Hills, where it was a promising, promising horror game. It game came out with a demo, the demo was freaking amazing, it was so promising, and then bullshit happens and it got cancelled. So, thank you everybody for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and don't don't forget to press that subscribe button right right below. Don't forget to press the subscribe button. Don't forget to click the like button. I want to have a record. I want to see if I can break over 20 likes for Resident Evil 7. I, I definitely want to see if I can break 20 likes for Resident Evil 7. Don't forget to click the like button. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Don't forget to leave your comments in the comment section. And I'll be seeing you guys the next time we, we have Res, when we have Resident Evil is when most likely when the new Res, the other Resident Evil the one that's not like hard based. The one that's more action-based called Resident Evil Umbrella Core. I definitely pre-order that. I definitely have that. So when that comes out, I'll definitely, definitely be doing playing some doing some videos for that. So once again, thank you all for watching. Thanks for all the support you guys give me. You guys are incredibly awesome. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And have a marvelous day, guys. Peace out and much love to you all. Ah.